It's another morning at Houston High, home of the Mustangs and HNN News. Whether it's the locker room or the classroom, Houston News Network is there. Your go-to source for all high school headlines. HNN News starts now. Good morning, Mustangs. I'm Michael Webb. And I'm Whit Minner. And these are your morning announcements for Tuesday, September 20th. It's Constitution Week, Mustangs. Constitution Week is celebrated annually during this week to commemorate the U.S. Constitution's history, importance, and bring attention to how it still serves today. Each day we'll give a fact about the Constitution. Today's fascinating fact is that George Washington and James Madison were the only presidents who signed the Constitution. Houston Choir sells pizza and drinks after school every Tuesday and Thursday through October. They are set up in two locations, one in the main lobby and the other in the fine arts hallway. Buy a slice for $2 and a drink for $1. The HHS yearbook is on sale now. Go to School Cash Online to make your purchase of the Mustang Spirit yearbook. The price is $90 and includes a personalized nameplate. Prices go up after Thanksgiving break, so buy yours today. If you're interested in playing tennis this year, there will be an informational meeting in the school library right after school today. 11th and 12th graders interested in applying for Houston Social Studies Honor Society, Ro Kappam. Information was posted by Mr. Robinson in the class of 2023 and 2024, Schoology pages. For any questions about joining Rogue Kappa, see Mr. Robinson in M213. The boys' basketball team will be selling Chick-fil-A chicken biscuits in the Varsity Gym concession stand on Friday mornings before school. The price is $5 for a biscuit and a bottle of water. h and News will be right back after this quick commercial break. So I'll get my wings and play, 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 play. And I'll put it on my face, 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 face. Baby, I'm just gonna shave, 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 shave. Shave it off. Shave it off. It'll take years off my age, 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 age. I'll be looking pretty really great, 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 great. Baby. Juniors and seniors, a lot of colleges and universities will be visiting Houston soon. Here's a look at the lineup for the coming weeks. All visits will take place either in the main lobby during all lunches or in the college office. Sign up for college visits in Naviance. Hi, my name is Cody, and I'm going to Ole Miss. Go Reps. My name is Brennan Williams. We're going to Oklahoma State. Go Pops! I'm Hank Fleming. I'm going to the University of Arkansas. Who pick? Hi, I'm Avery and I'm going to the University of Tennessee. Go Vols. I'm Okay, and I'm going to Auburn. Hey, I'm, I'm Todd Corbin. I'm going to Navy Beat Army. Hi, my name is Jackson. I'm going to the University of Arkansas. Who pick Suey? I'm Luke Roswell. I'm going to Nebraska. Go Huskers! It's College App Week with college activities every day. Wednesday is College Knowledge Trivia. Trivia questions will be posted on Schoology throughout fourth period. Be the first to the college office with the correct answer and win a prize. Thursday, there's a college fair in the PE gym during all lunches. And Friday is College Application Workshop Day. So learn how to fill out those college applications correctly. So take part and have fun with College App Week. doors for others is a common courtesy we all take part in, but opening doors for visitors at school creates a safety risk. If you see a former student you know trying to visit campus, don't open the door. If you see what seems to be a parent bringing food or a lost item to school, don't open the door. If you see someone trying to enter through a security gate, don't open the gate. All visitors must get buzzed into the building through the main office entrance, so follow the rules and help keep Houston safe. Welcome back. Now it's time for the HNN News Word Power Word of the Day. Today's Word of the Day is goad, a verb meaning to urge, spur, or incite to action. As in, Jim may think he's not going to fight Billy, but Billy will goad Jim on with insults until he throws a punch. Try using it today. Students and teachers, will you please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance?
Now in accordance with the laws of the state of Tennessee, we will observe a moment of silence. Well, that's it for today, Mustangs. Have a great day, and we'll be back with you bright and early tomorrow morning.